What's up, Wayne Baron here with darkfix.net and we are inside of Photoshop and well, we have an image here that I took a couple of weeks ago while talking to my son on the phone. I saw that there was fog in the background behind the house and I just thought it was really cool. And so I decided to bring this image in inside of Photoshop to see if I couldn't, you know, brighten it up, add in some darks and uh, well, make it look more like this, more natural. Okay, this is basically the way it looked like it didn't quite look like this. Now, I take the picture with a uh, Android cell phone, not with a high expensive camera. However, it came out beautiful after working with it in Photoshop. So, let's go ahead and do our, our video. So, let's choose no for that one. Okay, let's come over here to File, Open As, and then on our drop down, we're going to come down here and choose Camera Raw. We're going to select this image right here, and open it up. It's going to open it up inside of our camera raw. And as you can see, it's very bright and it just, it doesn't look natural. And we want to make it look a little bit more natural. So I've already got all the settings. So I'm just going to run through and basically show you what my settings are. And then you can try these settings inside of yours. All images are different. So we're going to do a minus 13. And then we're going to come down. We're going to do a minus 3 on this one. And then on our exposure, we're going to do a minus 0.65. So minus 0.65. And then on our contrast, we're going to do a uh, 26 on it. And then our highlights, we're going to set this at minus 23. And then we're going to choose whites at 20. And then our blacks, we're going to set this at minus 1. We're going to come down to clarity and set it at minus 4. And then our vibrance, we're going to set at 14. And then our saturation, we're going to set it at 8. And this right here gives us a really nice, more natural feel. This looks more like what it looked like that evening. Because this was taken about 6 o'clock in the evening. And it just, it just got finished running. And we had this beautiful fog back here. And so from this to this just makes it look better and almost photo framing qualities. And then after we get finished doing that, we want to come over here and choose save image. And then we want to choose our location and it's a green woods and fog. And we're just going to put a one right beside it. That way it will name it as that instead of overwriting my existing file. And then we're going to choose format Photoshop, or you can choose either one of these. We're just going to leave it at Photoshop. And then we're going to choose save. And then once it saves it, uh, we're going to come over here and choose open image. And then it's going to open up the image so that we can go in and do more editing to it if you need to do anything else. However, I like the way this looks, so I'm going to leave it as is. All right, Wayne Barron here with darkspaces.net inside of Photoshop Camera Raw and Photoshop CC 2014. All right, y'all have a good one now. Bye-bye.